Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. The Zaha represents a cutting-edge addition to the Turkish military's arsenal, serving as a versatile amphibious armored personnel carrier, APC, known alternately as the Marine Assault Vehicle, MAV. Developed by FNSS to fulfill the needs of the Turkish Navy, the project, named Zerli Amphibi Hukamaraklari, ZAHA, commenced with a contract signed in 2017. The vehicle scale model was unveiled in 2018, followed by the public debut of a prototype in 2019. Drawing inspiration from the venerable US of 7 adopted in the early 1970s, the Zaha shares similar dimensions and specifications but boasts advanced features characteristic of a new generation vehicle. The Turkish Navy has placed an order for 23 of these amphibious APCs along with four variants, with production already underway and delivery slated to commence in 2022. Notably, Turkey's venture into this vehicle class signals a strategic investment in bolstering its amphibious assault capabilities, with plans to offer the Zaha for export. Primarily intended for deployment from amphibious assault ships, the Zaha exhibits seaworthiness and swift traversal capabilities over short distances at sea. During amphibious operations, it facilitates the landing of troops on beaches and shores, ensuring the establishment of a secure perimeter for subsequent operations in hostile territory. Additionally, it serves as a conduit for transporting cargo and military supplies from ship to shore, thereafter supporting ground operations alongside other armored vehicles. Its versatility extends to tasks such as checkpoint security and patrol duties. Constructed with a hydrodynamic aluminum alloy hull, the Zaha benefits from enhanced rigidity compared to traditional steel hulls, resulting in a more spacious and structurally efficient interior. Its armor provides protection against small arms fire, artillery shell fragments, and offers the option for add-on modular armor kits to bolster defense capabilities against a variety of threats, including landmines and improvised explosive devices. Furthermore, crew safety is ensured through features such as an NBC protection system, automatic fire suppression, and a suite of countermeasures. Equipped with an unmanned turret, the Zaha is armed with a formidable arsenal comprising a 12.7mm heavy machine gun and a 40mm automatic grenade launcher. Operated by a crew of three, including a commander, gunner, and driver, it accommodates up to 21 dismounts in its capacious cargo compartment, with ingress and egress facilitated by a rear power-operated ramp. Alternatively, it can transport various cargo, military supplies, and smaller vehicles as needed. Powering the Zaha is a diesel engine generating approximately 500 horsepower, housed in the front compartment and coupled with an automatic transmission. Propulsion in water is facilitated by two rear-mounted water jets, enabling a maximum speed of 13 km per hour on water, while the vehicle retains the capability to traverse water using its tracks, albeit at a reduced speed, and can operate in up to sea state 4 conditions. That's all for now, see you later.